Welcome back, Valparaiso. I'm Storm Shield meteorologist John Hammersmith with you here today. And today's been election day, so if you haven't already went out there and voted, make sure you get out and cast your vote before the polls close this evening. The weather headlines that we will continue to deal with are some more seasonal temperatures. And then with a nice high pressure system visiting our area, we can expect a dry rest of the week. Taking a look outside at temperatures this evening, it's 52 here in Valparaiso, 52 in Laporte, and 53 in Gary. And then as we go through this evening into tomorrow morning, it's going to cool down a little bit, but temperatures will still be in the upper 40s. Then as we go into Wednesday evening, it's going to cool down a little bit with 46 here in Valparaiso, 48 in Gary. But it's when we move through Wednesday into Thursday morning, we can really see those 30 degree temperatures start to take hold, leaving us with a low temperature of 35 here in Valparaiso. Taking a look at future radar, you can see this band of rain off to our southeast, which visited us earlier today, moved out of the area, and there's still a couple clouds hanging around. And as we go through this evening into tomorrow morning, we're going to still have a little cloud deck over the area. But as we go through the day on Wednesday, that high pressure is going to start to take hold, and that's what's going to leave us some nice drier conditions and sunny skies. Taking a look outside tonight, we'll have a low of 44. With mostly cloudy skies, it's going to be a little gusty with a north wind of 10 to 15 miles per hour. But then as we go into tomorrow, there's that high temperature of 52 with a north wind of 5 to 10 miles per hour. Taking a look at your seven-day forecast, Friday is Veterans Day. It'll be a pretty nice day. It's going to be a little chilly with a high of 52 and then a low of 32 right around that freezing line. Then as we go into Saturday and Sunday and at the beginning of your next work week, you can see those colder seasonal temperatures, which are pretty normal for this time of year, start to take hold and leave us with high temperatures in the mid to upper 50s and lows in the 40s. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Storm Shield meteorologist John Hammersmith.